welcome back to the channel this is Joanne of Kaduna reporting for duty and hashtag sustainable Sunday if you've watched my one of my most recent videos titled recycling is a scam how they lie to us well you're doing well but if you haven't watched that video no problem no biggies after watching this video you could go back to watch that video the link will be in the description box down below now I still stand by the, I still stand with the opinion that reusing, reducing, repairing and rotting is way more important than recycling. But nonetheless, recycling is also that big part of the waste management puzzle that has to be fixed. We can't do this. We can't be able to uh, manage our waste effectively without putting recycling in the scheme of things. So recycling is also very important for us and for the environment. And in today's video, I'm going to convince you. Yes, I'm going to convince you why recycling is great for you and great for the environment. And you should definitely start recycling. If you don't know what recycling is. Recycling is a process of converting waste into useful and more productive materials. And the kind of things that you could recycle the, and the kind of things that you can recycle ranges from plastics, glass, aluminium, paper, magazines, cardboard boxes, like, and even electronics are part of the things that we could recycle. And I'm also going to tell you why recycling is beneficial to you and the environment just now. Firstly, the waste crisis is a global crisis. Now, if we keep on having fields are filled with synthetic waste, well, devastating effects like global warming will actually occur. And if you don't know, global warming is what gives rise right to climate change and is what making all of us run helter skelter right now. So you see, we not properly managing our waste is surely going to affect us in the long run, and it's already affecting us presently in the world as it is today. And so that. That's why, as I said earlier, recycling is the big part of the puzzle that is good. Of, is, and as I said earlier, recycling is a big part of the waste management puzzle that needs to be fixed. Recycling helps us do a whole lot more. Secondly, recycling helps conserve natural resources. Now, for every product that is being made, a lot of natural resources are being used to make that product come to life from your skincare to electronics to cars you use so even the spoon that you use a lot of natural resources have actually been used to make that pro those products come alive but when we can be able to recycle a lot of this when, but when we can be able to recycle we create a loop a circular loop that makes sure that the products that we already made from these natural resources when we recycle them they come back to another product and we keep on using them and we do not have to always go to stop the natural resources that are not in quantum, that are limited. We have limited natural resources and the, our wants and our needs are unlimited, but we can be able to find a way around not always going back to the limited natural resources that we have. That is fine and good. And that's where recycling comes into play. According to the United States Environmental Protection Agency, when you recycle a ton of paper, you save about 17,000 trees and about 17,000 gallons of water. Now that is a lot. Just you just by recycling just a ton of paper, you it helps to save all the smudge. Already differ already deforestation is a problem for us in the world as we're already having de deforestation problems and we are losing a lot of our carbon sinks. We don't know trees are carbon sinks and they help to hold in the carbon. When you recycle, you have to conserve natural resources and everyone is happy. The earth is happy, you are happy, and everyone is happy. Recycling helps to reduce carbon emissions and air pollution. Now look at the scenario in Nigeria. I'll always use Nigeria because I am living in Nigeria and I can be able to relate with Nigeria. So Imagine in Nigeria, we have a lot of waste that... Now imagine in Nigeria, especially as our waste management systems are a bit shitty. They are not doing... Our waste management system is faulty, it's not efficient, and it cannot be able to do the work that it's meant to do. But, and then you as an individual around the side, okay, since I do not have access to um waste management people people that come and pack my waste for me so well do you know what i'm going to do i'm just going to pack my waste and burn it 
and then when you burn your waist as i said synthetic waste are also part of this waste toxic fumes are emitted into the air carbon emissions are emitted into the air and then these carbon emissions will help to will help to increase global warming and global warming will help to improve or increase climate change and then we're all back to square one and in the process and also in the aspect of emissions of toxic fumes toxic fumes and soot could be emitted when we burn up some of this synthetic waste and we already seen in nigeria what soot is doing especially in port harcourt and Bielsa and their environs and how soot are really really disturbing them over there so now imagine we have soot and then we have these toxic fumes could also cause respiratory diseases heart related conditions lung diseases and a list of diseases that we do not want but when you recycle you help to reduce the occurrence of these things happening around you and you help to make the air cleaner recycling saves energy now imagine a company that utilizes recycled materials he's not going to use as much energy as a company that is making almost all their products or making use of veggie materials from scratch you have to making making use of veggie materials from scratch the company that it has been pro and this is with proven results companies that utilize recycled materials use way less energy are companies that manufacture from scratch and so you see in a business sense minimizing production costs is a win-win for every business person and recycling can help make that happen recycling also leads to the creation of jobs now compared to normal landfill waste management recycling creates six times more jobs than normal landfill waste management systems from pickup to taking to recycling centers to actually even recycling this waste you create more jobs and if we have more recycling centers and if recycling is more widespread in our country we get to have more jobs which is a thing we need more jobs in nigeria and if we can be able to create more jobs from the waste that is going to cost us more havoc is a win-win for everyone you make the environment safer and cleaner and you also get food on your table and food on the table of your children recycling also makes you money recycling also makes you money do you know that there are some recycling companies that actually pay you for the waste that you generate now you generate this waste but it's still them that are going to pay you to collect this waste from you like like Loan. <laughs> even in nigeria i know of a few recycling companies that actually do this they pay sometimes they pay either like with um, local waste speakers or even you the individual if you are really really serious about your recycling for a certain they usually have like a minimum they usually have like a minimum amount of waste that they could pay you a token for and this is a win-win for everyone gather your waste you clean the environment and you make waste management more effective more efficient and you have money in your pocket so even if you don't want to recycle for anything for the fact that you can make money from recycling that should be enough motivation to get you to start recycling now lastly my last point lastly recycling ensures a sustainable future when we recycle, we try to create this circular loop where you have this product, you recycle it, it's broken down, made to another product, you buy it, it, like, it creates a circular loop instead of like the linear loop, linear line of, linear form of um, consumption where you just buy, use, throw away. It doesn't help conserve resources, it's more expensive and it's telling on our environment. Instead, you buy, you use, you recycle, they make something new out of it, you buy it, it just creates a circular loop and it is great for sustainability. In sustainability, it's great if we can be able to do something that keeps on giving, keeps on creating and not just use, throw away, finish. We want something that keeps on creating at different forms of its lifespan and we keep on using at different forms of its lifespan and sustain and recycling makes that happen and also we can be able to teach our children 
the, and we can be able to imbibe recycling into the hearts of our children and wherever our children will always learn from our own actions from the actions of their parents from the actions of the society and we can make recycling widespread in nigeria and everyone can be able to recycle in one way or the other we have more recycling pickup points we have more recycling companies and people and we can be able to create that circular loop that we aim for in the world is a win-win for everyone for the environment for you and for your unborn generations so i hope that with these few points of mind i'll be able to convince and not confuse you that recycling is great for you and the environment thank you very much if you've watched this video up to now and if you are watching my videos for the first time you're doing well you're doing well you can subscribe don't leave without subscribing thank you <laughs> here we talk about sustainability and travel when we have the money to travel we do that so <laughs> till we have money to travel you can still subscribe travel content are coming soon coming to a screen near you right that's how you do it coming to a screen near you remember also to like share this video so that the gospel will reach more people and also comment i would love to know your own personal take on recycling have you ever recycled are you a recycle are you a recycling baba recycling novice or still think about how you want to go about this recycling journey i would love to hear your opinion in the description i would love to hear your opinion in the comment section in the comment box Yes, in the comment box down below. So until my next video, remember that you can be the change that you want to see. Joanna of Kaduna, signing out.